Please. You have to help me. They've got my daughter, my Paylith. The Veiled Heritance. I tracked her here, managed to take out this sentry before he could raise the alarm. But damn it! I'm an old man now. My sword arm is useless. Oriel protect you. Before he died, this bastard told me she's held in some ruins. Take this note, and this elixir of invisibility. The note holds everything I learned from this scum. The elixirs for Palith. Find her, as quick as you can. How would Palith get out then? I'm a better alchemist than a fighter, as you can see here. Least I know how to make a man talk. A member of the first Oridon Marines. I serve under Battle Reeve or Selmo. I'm currently on leave. My wife passed just recently. A heritance again. I was assigned to Queen Iren's detail, so my wife went to stay with her sister in Silsalen. The city was sacked, and they were both murdered by these bastards. I've lost enough to the Veiled Heritance. I won't lose my daughter. Please, you have to find her. You're an unexpected bend in the river. Not veiled heritance, yes. And obviously not packed. Perhaps we may be of service to one another. Argonians as a people are, yes. But these troops are no friends of mine. I want to teach these pigs a lesson. I help you, you help me. This crystal, take it. The pact has unloaded arcane cargo all around the cove. Simply touch the crystal to the cargo. The result should be... impressive. Careful, the crystal has a bite. Not always so friendly when unattuned. Yes, the crystal may backfire if not properly attuned. I can't. My magicka is bound. I could try. But if I exceed the power the stone allows me, pain, excruciating pain. I see I've chosen another trustworthy ally. Very well. I'll try. A moment. I must prepare the crystal. There. Now for the attunement. Hold still. And it's done. Take it, and good luck.
Maybe I should have joined the buoyant homages. I don't want to hurt you, but now I'm going to. Whoa! 
Get out of here. I won't say another word, so you'd just be wasting your breath. My father. Thank the stars. I'm tired of being a bargaining chip. They captured me to manipulate my brother, Aronimo. They had him do a job and then shoved him into a room in the ruins to the north. Bastards. That's my father, always thinking. But I can't. I can't leave without Aronimo. Thank you, and good luck. Yes? Who's there? Ah, good. I'm famished. Let's see. I'd like a breast of pheasant, some wine, and... a wheel of cheese. Ugh, my sister. It's her fault we're in this mess. The Heritons just wanted some information. No problem. But they insisted on taking Paylith as insurance to make sure I'd behave. Oh, hush. I didn't know they were in league with the Pact. Now you're here meddling, too. Fine. My escape won't be enough. I gave them some detailed military intelligence. Will you help me retrieve it? Do you want that information in the hands of the Pact? No, I didn't think so. I managed to hide one of their uniforms in my cot. Grab it, then we can slip past the soldiers and retrieve the information. Simple. Meet you outside, then. If we... None of these soldiers should recognize us. Thank <laughs> you. 
We have much to discuss. That was Iran, with the leader of the Pact Force, Rella. Your men aren't as good as you think, Iran. Get out of here. I need a moment. Hold on. Will you speak with me? Right. Now we can go find my sister. Ah, no. She still worships me, appreciates me, not like my old man. If father were here, he'd lash my hide. Father? Here? Oh, so he's waiting outside the cave then. Right, right, on the road. Um, would you mind if I hang back a few after we get out of here? You should go ahead. Tell him how helpful I was before I walk up. Good work. The crystal? Excellent. So now you see, this gem dampens my magicka. The crystal I gave you, along with a bit of spell work, should set me free. I will start the spell. Once I have the crystal weakened, I will tell you to use the crystal I gave you. Using it will be the final boost I need. Then, I shall be free. Ready? This should work. Now, use the crystal on the stone. Well done. Leave these pigs to your slaughter. May they rot. Thank you for your help. Shadow Fen awaits. Yeah! <laughs> 
to run away. Well, no, I guess it wouldn't. Maybe they should try that. I'll just wait here. I'll be along shortly, after I'm certain you've spoken to him. My daughter is found, and my no-good son as well, from what I hear. What? He? My son is a traitor? He gave deployment plans to the Heritance and the Pact? Did he tell you my wife, his mother, was murdered by the Veiled Heritance? That he's put all of Oridon in danger? More wives and mothers and daughters, just so he can feel important, like a big man? Look, Father, it's Aronimo. You! I told you I'd kill you if I ever saw your face again. No, Father, don't get upset. Please, I, I never meant to hurt anyone. You deserve no forgiveness. Lorcan, take you. Father, no. Please, do something. This is now official First Oridon Marine business. Your help is no longer required. I have to. This is justice. He's a traitor to the Crown, to his family. He's a traitor to the Crown. He's committed treason, murder, and theft. How do I justify that? Even as his father. It's my duty. I never thought I'd live to see the day. I've failed. I've failed as a father and as a soldier. Eronimo, I am a first Oridon Marine. It's my duty to carry out the punishment for, for treason and murder. The sentence is death. Do you have anything to say? I'm grateful. How can you treat your own son this way? Father, no! Don't do it! Yes, listen to Paylith. You'll regret this. The Eight may grant you mercy. I cannot. No! Could it be I made the wrong decision? At least he was slain by the sword of his father in private, rather than in public by a hooded executioner. Cold comfort. Thank you. Vexing for some competition. Aronimo was a good myrrh. He only wanted to do what he thought was right in his heart. <laughs> 